Hi there, what you're seeing here today is an interrupt-driven music player that I wrote for the Commander X16. The files it plays back are just streams of register values with a delay or yield built in. It's very, very similar to a VGM file. And so what I did was I wrote a converter to take VGM files and convert them into a format suitable for this player. Let's listen and I'll cut to the original a couple of times. So I think it's clear that the original has a much fuller sound, even though it's also using only the YM2151 sound chip. Okay, so let's just do the same thing again, but this time using a readout from Afterburner 2. So there is no user interface per se, um, you have to poke at it to get it to go and play the different songs that you want. But um, it's a very simple API, so as an example, let's say that we uh, put into the music class the mask FF, that matches every song. So you can classify songs by a simple bit mask, and if the mask matches it'll play the song. So if we start this player with this... If I now go up to the next song and I hit that, then yep, we get to the next song. And if I then go and do this print, it prints out the music bank that is currently active. So you can see that this song is playing from memory bank 5 and the next song is playing from memory bank 10. I can also say that I want to play back a specific song, so if I come and I set this number, Six, I will play song seven really because it's um, zero based, but that way I get to play the specific song. And then I can change this mask to match one, and I've got three songs set up to match mask one. So when I go through and I set the bit one in that mask and I say next song, then I get one of them, another one, and another one. So uh, that's also a way to select songs, say that you tagged it for user interface or in-game or the win song or whatever it is. And you can just set the mask and say play these class of songs and that is what you will see. So it's a very very simple little player, easy to integrate and works great in the Penetrator game. The one other thing that I uh, need to show you is just this um, command line interface program called VGM Clean and this is the it's also checked into the project and that is the um, the cleaner basically that turns VGM files into the appropriate files and it can cut it into 8k chunks and pad it out and put in delays and everything that you need to do so that's it that's the whole thing um, the links are in the description and uh, thank you very much for watching appreciate it